All right, team, Tuesday morning. Another load of bikes, plus a recumbent exerciser bike. And I guess some kids' bikes, like a scooter. Anyway, got to get it unloaded because we got a guy come and look at this today. A guy came and looked at it yesterday. Uh, and it was too big for the space. He measured it, went home, measured it. It was just too big. But he did buy something else from Mrs. Duggar. I don't remember what. And, uh... Anyway, I got a guy come and look today, and I guess he's buying it. He just... I guess it fits or whatever. <laughs> it's going. Um, I may check back with you. We're going to do some scrapping, but I don't know if I'll film it. We'll see what happens. Uh, team. Wednesday morning. I don't know. We added a few things. Not very much, but we added a few things. Ooh. I take it we gave up on the daybed. I didn't load that on, so I'm guessing we gave up on it. Uh, today's the big, big day. Got our fridge plugged in. The energy company called last night, gave us a reminder... And then whoever's picking it up, I don't remember the name, they called and gave us a reminder. Uh, ah, I think he said he'd be here between 10 and 12, so they give you a two-hour window even. So, uh, so far I'm pretty pleased with the way the program works. Um, Mrs. Duggar sold that big TV hutch too. Uh, you know, the doors flipped out and then slid back in and it's gone. Sold it yesterday. Uh, second guy came and looked at it. The first guy, uh, I think I told you, it was too big. It wouldn't fit where he wanted it. And the second guy showed up, and he he bought it and took it home. So that was pretty cool. Anyway, we're going to grind away at this stuff again. Um, I really need to do some appliances, but as you can see, I, I unless I want to do them out in the driveway... <laughs> I don't really have enough room to do them. So we'll just keep grinding away, guys. All right, team. Friday morning. Skip ahead. Uh, we did get this treadmill Thursday. We already stripped it, put it on here. We got our table saw stripped. Uh, our radio arm thing stripped. We got the wall oven done. It's on here. Not sure. I think I might do this one today. Strip this guy and get it on there today. Um, I got plenty to work on. Oh, we did do this dishwasher. And we filled it with buckets of knick-knacky stuff. Like, like this kind of a bucket. Or this kind of a bucket. We filled it, and then we, uh, I like to screw them closed. Uh, just because the whole idea of putting it in there is so when the magnet picks it up, it gets off the trailer. Uh, and if the door pops open while he's trying to grab it, then it all dumps on the trailer. And, uh, uh, you know, you got to sweep it or kick it off or something. <laughs> That's the whole point of putting it in there, though, so you don't have a bunch of loose stuff on the trailer. Anyway, guys, that is the plan. We'll just keep scrapping. Uh, we did pick up a bicycle, bike frame, and maybe two wheels. So, pickups have kicked back a little bit. But anyway, it's okay. We got a back stock of scrap to work on anyway. Catch you later. All right, team. Saturday morning. We stopped by our once-a-week place. Our new guy. Got some more uh, tires and stuff. <laughs> uh, we did get a fire pit, um, dog kennel. Mrs. Duggar sold all three other dog kennels we had in stock, so we're out. Now we got one. Uh, more bicycles, classics. Like real, real classics. These tires are like sun rotted, like so bad that they actually ripped. Anyway, we did get a stove or a range, a uh, shower chair, I think I mentioned the fire pit. 
Uh, and like a dresser thing. A nightstand, two drawer dresser thing. Uh, I think that's the excitement. Let me, let me run over here real quick. Saturday morning, we uh, did our treadmill yesterday. And we did some, uh, you won't notice it in there things. <laughs> some small stuff that we just hucked in there. Uh, which gave us some more floor space. Uh, we took this off the trailer because it wasn't ready to go. I'm wondering if I can't maybe sell that as a like a go-kart motor or something along those lines. Mini bike. Who knows? Anyway, we did get some floor space back. But now I'm probably going to lose it because I got to unload. Anyway, guys, we'll catch you later. All right, team. Saturday night, Sunday morning. Another edition of Late Night Scrapping. We've already been working at it. Um, uh, you can just, you know, I don't know. If, you'd have to look at earlier video, but we got a lot more carpet showing. Uh, I'll just pan you around uh, the fridge. Uh, the guy did come and pick it up. Uh, he called and he showed up during the window. I want to say it was around 1030. I didn't see him. Um, but uh, I guess he showed up, verified it was working. He cut the cord off. He Tommy lifted it up into his truck. And then he opened the freezer, took a hammer, and bashed the shell inside there. Then he... Uh, Open the fridge part, bash the shell inside the fridge, uh, basically made it unusable, and uh, hauled it away. Now, supposedly, we will get a check mailed to us from uh, the electrical company. So, we'll see how that works out. I'll have to let you know. I have no doubt I'm getting a check. I don't know how long it will take. But anyway, uh, so... Really pleased with that program. I think it worked great. Uh, very hassle-free. I mean, we set it up online. Guys showed up with a two-hour time window, picked it up. A little suspicious. Maybe they'd recondition the fridge and resell it, but, you know, he basically bashed it up. Mr. Duggar's standing there. He cut the cord off and bashed it up so it couldn't be used. So, I mean, it was interesting. And like I said, supposedly we can do two a year. I don't know if that's calendar year, or I assume it's calendar year. Anyway, guys, we're going to do some midnight scrapping or late night scrapping, and uh, I'll check back with you later. All right, team. Sunday night, Monday morning, late night scrapping again. Um, the focus will be, uh, I like to work on the blue one. I like to work on this blue one. That blue one. And the gray one. That's all. Uh, that's all aluminum. Uh, mostly from our new guy, the once a week guy we just picked up. I don't know. It's probably been a month now. But <laughs> that's ready to go. Anyway, I, I've acquired more buckets of. I'll do it later. So I'd like to focus on that. We have done some pickups Saturday and Sunday. Um. So, I'll have to show them to you later. It's dark out. Anyway, that is going to be tonight's adventure. Alright team, Monday morning. Uh, this is Sunday pickups. A couple wheels and a treadmill. Wheel on this. Saturday pickups. We got a treadmill and this little pile of bicycles. You've seen the chairs. Uh, you've seen the desk. I don't know if you've seen the table saw stand. But it is not new. It's been hanging out for a while. I think we're, we're going to sell it. So it was hanging out on the east side. Uh, there should be nothing new here. Uh, you've seen the fire pit. Um, yeah, you've seen all this. Fire pit was in the trailer with the dog kennel. That stove was in the trailer with the dog kennel. Anyway, we did do our totes. Um, we did them to my satisfaction at this point in time. 
we did not 100% empty the totes. Some of it went into a new tote. <laughs> but that tote's gone. And the three here are gone except for, I think, that one. Because that one had a lot of brass in it and some aluminum in it. And But we did, we did pick out the easy stuff. We did pick out the easy, easy stuff. Anyway, we added to our aluminum tote. Um, and then, you know, we still got buckets of I'll do it later. Bucket after bucket of I'll do it later. So, we'll probably, uh, I gotta do some driveway cleansing, but then we'll get back on our buckets of do it later. But for now, it's the end of the video. So, uh, thanks for watching. Take it easy. I'll catch you next time, guys.